Naraya. You look so cute. <laughs> you ready to go to school now? Hmm? Are you stuck in portrait mode or something? Mm -hmm. Snap out of it. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Shantae's Way here today. Today I'm going to be showing you how I take down Naraya's braids and have like a braid out. Naraya just has four really big braids in her hair and she has worn it all week long. And basically what I do is I put oil on my hands. And the reason why I put oil on my hands is just because I want her hair to not accumulate as much frizz. Because these braids are super old and they've been in all week, they are gonna have a lot of frizz but I just don't want the frizz to be like so much that she doesn't have any curl pattern so basically I put the oil on my hands and I begin to take out the braids and off camera I actually put some leave-in conditioner on her braids and I actually sprayed it with water just to re-moisturize her hair because Naraya's hair needs a lot of moisture and in order for it to look halfway decent it does need to be re-moisturized so I just went ahead and did that off camera Mama Super Mama, Jama Llama, Big Fat Mama Llama. I don't know who your mother is. In <laughs> fact, I don't know who you are. <laughs> taking down Naraya's braids I normally put a headband on her hair just because her hair is super old and normally I do work on super old hair because I keep Naraya's hair in the protective style if, so if I would have just braided her hair the night before and then take took it out in the morning then I wouldn't really need a headband but because her hair is super old I like to put a headband on and I'm also laying down her baby hairs <laughs> and I just fluff it out. I make sure that I moisturize her ends too because like I told you guys in her wash day routine, the ends of her hair is always super, super dry. So I always have to make sure that I moisturize them a lot because yeah, if not, it's going to be very dry and it's not gonna look right and they're just gonna be super frizzy. I'll leave the product below on which I use to moisturize her ends. And that's pretty much it for her braid out. A lot of you wanted me to do like some type of style on Naraya's hair or um, show styles that I do on her hair. And honestly, I just like to keep it super simple. It's really hard to record Naraya's tutorials because she's always all over the place. But I just wanted to show you guys quickly what her hair looks like um, on a braid out. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, then please give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next one.